Hi, Troy here with Duro Dancing, and you've been asking for it, so now we finally have it. This is the tutorial for Off the Chain, done to the song I Can't Believe It by Flo Rider and Pitbull. Now this is 64 count, two wall dance that's phrased and has a tag in it. And this is done by an amazing crowd for Fred Whitehouse. So we're gonna get going, I'm gonna stop talking, get ready to dance your pants off, because we're gonna have a lot of fun. Come on in, guys. All right, let's get started with part A. I'm gonna turn around and see my boots are doing. So for our first four counts, you're gonna move forward on your right foot. You do three hit steps. So one, two, and three, and four. Okay, so I'm gonna show what that looks like from the side. You're gonna press forward on that. One, two, and three, and four. So you hit pressing every time. Now at the end of that four count, you're gonna do a jazz box turn. Just take your right foot and cross over for five, Turn six, turn seven, eight. And now you're gonna face your three o'clock wall. All right, so let's do that all again. Press it forward with your right foot. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, and four. Box five, six, seven, eight. All right, let's do it just a little bit faster because that's how the beat goes. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, and four. Five, six, seven, eight. All right, for your second set of eight counts, now you're gonna do some hip rolls and some body rolls. So the first step, you tap out with your right toe and you do a little hip bump. So it's one, two. Then you can do the same thing with your left foot. Three, four. Then from here, you're gonna step out with your right and you're gonna body roll. Or if you want to, you got a little style, you can do a little booty roll with it. But we're gonna go move to the right for five, six. Then you move to your left, seven, eight. And all weight wants to be on that left foot when you're done with that. All right, so let's show that again. So five, six, right tap, go. One, two, three, four, roll. Five, six, seven, eight. All right, let's put all 16 counts together, okay? So we're starting off with our hitch steps, followed by our jazz box, and then some pops. So here we go. Start with your right foot. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, and four, box. Five, six, Seven toe bump, one, two, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, eight. All right, let's try it again one more time, just a little bit faster, a little bit more to song tempo. It's kind of a faster song. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, and three, and four, box, five, six, seven toe tap, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, for your third set of eight counts, we're gonna do what's called a syncopated weave step. Now, syncopated is the fancy name for saying it goes with the music and the beat and rhythm. So when you hear the song, you'll understand what I mean. Now, we should be facing our three o'clock wall, but I'm gonna teach it facing this wall so you can see what's going on, because it's a little bit of a quick step, all right? So we just finished our roll count, right? We're over here, we're facing the wall. And you're gonna do a weave step. You step out with your right foot for one, then behind it for two, then out and cross in front, three, crop out again, and tap four. So you can see we're going behind, in front, and behind. That's the weave step. So we do this in time and rhythm. It should go one, two, and three, and four. Okay? So just for fun, let's actually face this wall and do it together, okay? So you just did your body rolls. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two and three and four. Now from here, you're gonna step out with your left foot and start a turn for five. Then you're gonna do another turn, six. Then you're gonna do two hops, quarter turns, seven, eight, and end up facing in your 12 o'clock wall. All right, so let's do that really, really slow. And face this wall with single painted weaves. So you finish all weights on that left foot, five, six, seven, eight, one, two and three and four, five, six, seven, eight. And you're facing that front wall. I know, it's faster, so let's actually do it to the tempo. Here we go. I'll wait on that left, right here. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two and three and four, 
five, six, seven, eight. All right, let's do all three counts, three sets of eight counts together, okay? It's a lot, and we're still on it, but here we go. All right, here we go. Starting with our pop steps. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, and four. Box five, six, seven, to the top. One, two, three, roll. Five, six, seven, single pain weave. One, two, and three, and four. Five, turn six, turn seven, eight. All right? Let's do it to the actual beat. <laughs> here we go. All right, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, and four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, weave. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, turn, seven, eight. All right, the last four counts of A are actually pretty simple, probably simple than the other counts. So this one you step. So you just finish your two hop steps, turn back to the front, right? So we're back to here. So we're gonna do two pivot turns. A pivot turn is pretty simple. Step over with your right foot for one, go up on your toes, pivot turn two, and you're forward on your left foot, then step forward again with your right foot. For three, up on those toes, pivot turn for four. So it goes one, two, three, four. Think about it like you're a basketball player and that's your pivot foot, you can't pick it up or else you travel. That might work. <laughs> All right, so once we do that, step again, we go one, two, three, four. We're gonna do another jazz box turn, but this time instead of a quarter turn, we're gonna do a half turn. So you gotta cross that for five, six, turn seven together, eight, and you're facing your back wall. All right, so it's a little bit more than the other ones. So you gotta remember which one you're on. All right, let's do that again. Just did your double bounces, two pivot turns, and a jazz box half turn. Five, six, seven, eight, one, turn two, three, turn four, box five, six, seven, eight. All right guys, you now know all of A. So let's put it all together. We're gonna do it twice, slow first, then fast, so you can get all of it down. Again, this is A. Start with those hip steps. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, and three, and four, box five, six, seven, toe tap, right, one, Two, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, we've set. One, two, and three, and four, turn five, six, bump, seven, eight, step one, turn two, three, turn four, five, six, turn together. And hopefully, you're not dizzy. Don't worry, if the room's spinning on you, it's not because of spicy lemonade, it's probably just because that's a lot of turns. All right, let's do it again, a little more tempo. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, one, Two and three and four box five six seven turn tap one two three roll five six seven we step one two and three and four five turn six five seven turns one turn two three turn four box five six turn seven eight all right now you know all of a so now it's time to teach you the b sequence now here's something that's kind of helpful is when you face the back wall is when you will only time you'll ever be doing B. You'll never do B facing the front wall. It's a two wall dance, it just happens on this one. And you'll kind of hear it with the ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum, bubble yum. You'll, you'll hear it in the song, I'm, I'm not uh, the rapper. So anyways, so let's talk about how it works. I'm actually gonna face this way against you see but the first time we do it, it's gonna be facing the back wall. So at this point, the first part is you're gonna kick out for one, together and you're gonna kick one, and switch weight, tap out two. Then you're gonna kick with your left foot for three together and four. So you're switching that weight. One and two, three and four. One more time, kicking with your right, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four. Now here's where a lot of things get weird, right? We're actually gonna cross over, do a cross rock recovery. So you can take that right foot, you're gonna go, Five, out, and with the rock, cover six. Then you're gonna cross seven, rock, and eight. So it becomes this five and six, seven and eight process. All right, so let's just work that one more time, okay? So we just did our last kick out. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, and eight, okay? So let's put all that eight count together, just so we can feel how it is. So kicking with your right foot first, kick and out. Here we go. 
So five, six, seven, eight, kick one and two, kick three and four, cross five and six, seven and eight. And really work that until you get the rhythm down, the beat down, it goes with the music. I had to do it a lot of times before I finally got the rhythm down. All right, let's try it again, a little bit faster. Here we go, five, six, seven, eight, one and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. Okay, now as I mentioned, the first time we actually do this part, we're facing the back wall. So let's do it facing the back wall once at least. I know it might be a little weird with you looking at the camera with me, but if you have to, um, just visualize it, okay? <laughs> so we're kicking with the right foot. Five, six, seven, kick. One and two, three and four, cross five and six, cross seven and eight. All right, all weights on the left foot. Okay, so now we're on to the second set of eight counts in B. You know, it's really confusing. Look in the uh, notes in below and it will tell you kind of how the start goes. So from here, you're gonna do some chug steps. So we gotta turn around to the front wall, you're gonna take your right foot, pivot off your left foot, and you're gonna go one, two, three, four. And that gets you back to the front wall. And then we're gonna do those same cross rock recover steps for five and six, seven and eight. Okay? So the easiest part of this for me was I had to think it in my head, right? It went one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, and eight. All right, let's try it just a little bit faster. And so we just finished our last rock and cross, chugging five, six, seven, chug, one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, and eight. All right, let's put all 16 counts of B that we know so far, okay? So here we go. From the top, we're gonna face the back wall and do it right, so we're kicking out. So here we go. Five, six, seven, kick right, kick one out, two, kick three out, four, cross five and six, cross seven and eight, chug one, two, three, four, cross five and six, seven and eight, okay? Let's do that one more time, just for good measure. Here we go. Five, six, seven, kick right, kick one out, two, kick three out, four, cross five and six, cross seven and eight, chug one, two, three, four, cross five and six, seven and eight. Okay, that was all of B bringing you back to the front wall where you'd actually be at a restart. The first time you do this, it's B without restart. So let's continue on with B for the next time you do it. Again, I'll explain it all a little bit later and you'll see it in the video. But you're gonna start hearing those pops, you're gonna start hearing how the music goes through. All right, so second time we do B, we're doing the full B, okay? Not with the reset. So we get all the way around and we just did our cross and cover, cross rock or cover, okay? Now from here, it's pretty simple. You're gonna do another four chug steps to get back to the back wall. One, two, three, four. And then from here, you're gonna step out and do two chest pumps, five, six, then bring your left foot together for seven, eight. Okay? So let's do that again. So this is part B, the full version, set number three. Chugging, right foot's out, chug to the left, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, pop, five, six, seven, eight. And really in those chest pumps, you can do whatever you want, however you really want to play, okay? All right, for our next set of eight counts out of B, right? We just did the rock and crosses, we did the turn, we did the chest pumps. Now we're gonna do the chest pumps again to get us back to the front wall, okay? So we just did our chest pumps, chest pumps. So here we go, five, six, seven, eight, pump, one, Two, three, four, pump, five, six, seven, eight. All right, so how about this? We're gonna put all of B together, all the counts that we know, all the way through the kicks, the chugs, through the cross rocks, and the chest bumps, okay? So you're facing the back wall. When we do this, we're gonna do it slow first, then fast. And here we go. First one is your kick right. Five, six, Seven kick right, kick one out two, kick three out four, cross five, cover six, seven, cover eight, chug one, two, three, four, cross five and six, cross seven and eight, chug one, 
two, three, bumps, five, six, seven, eight, chug, one, two, three, four, pop, five, six, seven, eight. Okay? So now you kind of see how all of me goes together. Repeat that as many times slow as you need to, but let's take it up a notch for right now. Here we go. All right. Five, six, seven, eight, kick once, out, two, kick three, out, four, cross, five, and six, cross, seven, and eight, chug, one, two, three, four, cross, five, and six, cross, seven, and eight, chug, one, two, three, four, pop, five, six, seven, chug, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right? And now you know. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. Done this a lot, and now I've realized it's really hard with a choreographed song like this sometimes to get when they change their name. So we're gonna run through the pattern real quick all the way up to the tag. I'll teach you the tag after this, okay? So the way this works is you do A, B with the restart, so not the full B. Then you're gonna do A three more times, and then the full B, A three more times, then the full B, and we'll stop. But we're gonna do all that right now, okay? So we're gonna walk through it, I'm just gonna go slow, we're not gonna do it fast, but this way you can kind of get your tempo and your timing of when things happen, okay? Okay, so here we go. From the top, doing that hitch set first. Five, six, seven, go, A, and one, two, and three, and four, box five, six, seven, toe, bounce, one, two, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, single pain weave, one, Two and three and four, turn five, six, hop seven, eight, pivot one, turn two, three, turn four, box five, six, seven. Now B and kick and out, kick and out, cross rock recover, cross rock recover, chug one, two, three, four, five and six, seven and eight. Restart one, two and three and four, box five, six, seven, toe tap one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, turn seven, eight. One, two, three, box turn, five, six, eight, again. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, toe tap. One, two, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, single pain weave. One, two, and three, and four, Five, turn, six, hop, seven, eight, one, pivot, turn, three, turn, five, six, seven, eight, again, one, two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, seven, weave, one, two, and three, and four, five, six, turn, seven, eight, one, turn, two, Three, turn four, box five, six, seven, all of B. One out, two, three out, four, five and six, seven and eight, chug. One, two, three, four, five and six, seven, chug again. And one, two, three, that's pumps. Five, six, seven, eight, chug. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight again. One, two and three and four, five, six, seven, toe tackle. One, Two, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, single pain. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, turn, two, three, turn, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, toe tap. One, two, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, we step. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, turn, seven, eight. One, turn, two, Three, turn four, five, six, last time, A. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, toe tap. Two, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, turn two, three, turn four, five, six, all of B. One, out, two, three, out, four, cross, five, and six, seven, and eight, chug, one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, and freeze. Okay? All right, Whew. That's everything all the way up to the tag. So do that as many times as you want, need to, but that becomes your process. Again, it's A, most of B, but the restart without the second set of chugs. 
Three more A's, all of B. Three more A's, and all of B again. All right, so let's take you now through the tag. I'm gonna break it down again into eight counts and we'll keep doing it. That way you can kind of get the, the gist of it because it takes a little bit. Luckily, it starts off by telling you what to do. All right, so we just finished our last chug steps in B, and we did our pop steps, pop steps, okay? So all weight is actually on your right foot. Now you're gonna do a turning, move to your left with the clap. So you're gonna turn over your left shoulder, so you're gonna go one, two, three, four. And you bring your toe together, then clap. And then you're gonna go to the right for five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so let's do that again all together, all eight counts. Five, six, seven to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, now for the second set of eight counts in our tap. Right? We just did our rolls left and right. So we end up here. We're gonna jump out for one, out one, then cross two, right over left, two, then unwind three, four, and you're gonna face the back wall. From here, you're gonna roll right, then left. And you can do it however you want. You can do this, you can do this, whatever you feel comfortable with, but you just wanna make sure you go to the right with the body roll, to the left with the body roll. So let's do that again. So weight is on your right foot, left foot tapped, you jump out, cross, unwind. So five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, let's put all 16 counts of that tag together, all right? <laughs> so we just finished our chugs and our chest bumps, right? Okay, here we go. Moving to the left. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, now for our third set of eight counts in the tap. <laughs> All right, I'm actually gonna turn this way. I guess you can see exactly what's happening, but we face the back wall when we do this, okay? So we just did our um, unwind, roll right, roll left. We're gonna do a syncopated weave to the right with two chest pumps. So you're gonna take your right foot forward. One, two, and then together three with a pop, pop. Three in, okay? Then you're going to the left for five, six, and seven, eight. All right, so I'll show that again a little faster. So we just did our right, left, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. And you're going to kind of be moving a little forward when you do that. Okay, so one more time. Again, you face the back wall when you do this one. It's the only time. So roll left, roll, roll right, roll left. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. Okay, let's put all three sets of eight counts together for the tap, all right? So we're facing the front wall when this happens again. Rolling left, rolling right. All the things, all the things, still got more. Here we go, five, six, seven, turn left, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, turn, three, four, roll, five, six, seven, eight, we have one, two, and three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. Okay, that's the whole three counts of the attack. Let's try it one more time, a little bit faster because I want you guys to get to it. You'll know it in the music, because it was it. She turned left, she turned right. Again, I don't sing, so just me here Okay? All right, here we go. Tag. This is after pit bull sings. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, wait. One, two, and three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. Okay, the last set of eight counts in the tag is a lot of fun, it's a little quick, but it's pretty simple, okay? So you just did your sink foot weave and pop, pop, okay? You're gonna stomp off with the right foot for one, stomp, two, drop your head down, three, four. Now he says drop it low or something like that, so ladies, you can drop it however you want to, but it should go 
One, two, three, four. Then you're gonna hop together for five, five, hold six, and then you kinda hear this little ding ding ding, ding sound. You can do a little wiggle, a little shimmy, a little shake, however you want. All right? So let's go through that again. We just finished with our chest pops off our left side. So we're stopping right, left, drop, up, together, wiggle. So five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, let's put the whole tag together. Slow, then fast, all right? Now you're almost done with this whole song, I promise. So much fun, so much fun. All right, so the tag from the very start, facing the front wall, turn to the left. Here we go. Five, six, seven, turn. One, two, three, turn. Five, six, seven, jump. One, two, turn, three, four, roll. Five, six, seven, weave, step. One, two, and pop, pop. Five, six, and pop, pop. Right, left, drop. Up, together, shim. Okay? Let's do it a little faster. Tempo, only straight counts. If I can keep up with the voice. There we go. All right, turning left. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, now you know the whole tag. Again, that comes after Pitbull and the chorus, and it starts saying, turns left, turns right. So it kind of gives you a little bit of cue getting you facing the front wall when that happens. Now, after you finish the tag, what do you do next? It's really simple, but hard, <laughs> all right? What you're gonna do is you're gonna immediately go into B, because you're facing the back wall, all of B, and then A repeatedly till the end of the song. So the way it looks, just to kind of get you set on that, right, is you do right, left, down, up, together, wiggle, then you're gonna kick one and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. So you go into your full B. So be ready for that when it comes out. That was the biggest thing I had a problem with, but that should get you going. Again, after your right, left, drop, up, together, wiggle, you kick out and out, okay? Man, is your brain fried? Not only is it off the chain, but it's just out of your mind, right? That's okay, just keep practicing, keep trying. You'll eventually get the phrasing down, listen to the song. You'll eventually get all the turns, everything down. I promise you, just take it slow at first and then keep going. Guys, we appreciate you tuning in, but there's only one thing left to do. If you're ready, if you're brave enough, click on that link in the upper right corner. It's gonna take you to the Stomp It Out video where you can dance with me. All right guys, we'll see you there.